we are here for the installation of the Chancellor as well as the, her first um, end of the year message to the university. So the election of a chancellor is not an everyday occurrence. Uh, in fact, UCT in its history um, has had five chancellors to date, and the election of uh, Dr. Precious Maloy Motsepi uh, will see her appointed as chancellor as the sixth chancellor of the university. I now call on the chair of the UCT council to address us. We are here today to witness a moment of immense pride and promise. It is indeed a moment of recognition of how far we have come and what promise and opportunity lie ahead. And I wish you a warm welcome. So this is an important day for the University of Cape Town. It's a history in the making to have three black African women at the helm of the university, being the Chancellor, Precious Moloi Mutsepe, the Chair of Council, yours truly, Baba Luango Nyama, and the Vice Chancellor, uh, Professor Mamukhete Pake. It's such a pleasure, and it says a lot about how the university itself embraces humanity and moves humanity forward. How do I begin to articulate the successes of such a phenomenal black woman? Dr. Precious Moloi Mozepi is a philanthropist and an entrepreneur and is recognized as one of the 50 most powerful women on the African continent as recognized by Forbes Africa. Her philanthropic and business interests are intertwined, focusing on education, women, youth empowerment, and the creative arts industry. As the SRC, we are proud to be part of this installation of such a phenomenal black woman who is pro the youth development. I thank you. For students, an event like this means primarily, I think, the celebration of black women in our university and the incredible work that they've done to make sure that the university runs well. As the SRC, we are incredibly proud to be led by a trio of strong black women and we are proud and we want to make sure that this goes forward in, in the future. I will now invest you with a gown of office and after which you will be invited to sign the university's golden book. You're welcome. What today means for me is a real step in the right direction for our university, for our students, and all staff at the university. Uh, it is really significant because it is after 20 years that we are getting to install the next chancellor, which uh, I am very grateful to the convocation and the university for having bestowed this honor on me. It really means a lot because I'm very passionate about education. I am a product of uh, education coming from the townships and being a medical doctor and now being elected chancellor of one of the top universities in Africa and one of the best in the world. What I hope to bring to the university as chancellor is a focus on excellence in education, in everything that we do, in research, um, ensuring that we stay as the best university that can attract the best scholars from the continent and that we get recognized for the work that comes from this amazing youth institution globally 
and that we contribute to global knowledge. I also hope to continue and support the executive in their quest to ensure that UCT is inclusive and that the transformation at the university is cross-cutting from our leadership at the top right up to the student and staff and across all faculties. At this symbolic convocation, and though I have been Chancellor for almost two years already, I gratefully receive the ceremonial title from the University of Cape Town as I take over from former Chancellor and former First Lady, Ms. Grasa Michelle. Dr. Mule Mutsepe, I congratulate you, and it is my hope your leadership at UCT will drive further the transformation of this highly prestigious institution. Chancellor, this is your university. We are so delighted that you agreed to be our leader because you are the caliber of leadership that resonates with us and who we want to be as a university. And so as you take us with you in your 10-year tenure, we hope that we will rise to the occasion so that we can live up to your international standing and the respect that you have can rub on us and the honor that you have can also rub on us. So thank you for being willing to work with us. We know you don't need us, but we need you and we're delighted that you're here with us.